Today's topic, I'd like to talk to you a little bit about pitching. It's a very important skill with regard to scoring. Um, we can see that on TV on a weekly basis with how well the pros perform in this area. Pitching really is bringing all three elements of a consistent strike, a consistent trajectory, and consistent speed. Okay, so let's make a start. We'll talk very briefly about the, the basic setup conditions that we're trying to achieve. First of all, I'm going to make the club a little bit shorter, gripping down the handle. I'll take up my stance position, fairly narrow, a couple of club head widths apart, and with the ball centre and weight favouring my left side. Okay, typically with our clients here at uh, Emirates Golf Academy, we tend to see a lot of movement, good positioning here, but from here, the release and the delivery of the club to the ball tends to work more in a dragging fashion, dragging the club back down to the ball. Now this can cause a lot of difficulties in terms of the strike trajectory and also the speed and distance that the ball goes. Because from here I either have to compensate and flip with my hands or compensate and open up my body which changes my dynamic balance. So I've got a drill for you to help you improve your strike, your trajectory, your speed and distance control. Okay, so let's talk a little bit about this uh, Peter Kahn signature pitching drill. We call it the reverse hand or the cack hand drill. So as a right-handed golfer, typically I would have my right hand on the bottom, my left hand on top. What I'm actually gonna do for this drill is I'm gonna swap my hands around. So I'm gonna put my right hand on top, taking my thumb off the shaft. I'm now gonna put my left hand below with my thumb on top of the shaft. So that's my gripping position. Okay, let's take up my setup position from there. So I'm not gonna change my setup positions. Still making the club shorter, gripping down. Still a narrow stance and still favoring my weight on the left side. So from here, I'm gonna really focus on my movements that are gonna give me a consistent arc and a consistent delivery back to the ball, which will bring my hands and wrists underneath my chest and allow me to maintain my balance dynamically, rather than having to make a compensation here or a compensation here. So let's have a look and see what it looks like. Okay, so that was a really clean strike, nice direction, good speed, good trajectory, and good distance control. And those are all the good ingredients for solid pitching and a solid pitching technique.